born again are a new creation. If I go anywhere in the world, I meet a Christian who is a spirit-filled Christian, I have a brother in Christ. I have a brother in Christ. Those who are led by the Spirit are the true sons of God. It doesn't matter what church you go to, those who are led by the Spirit are the true sons of God. Jesus said, you will know a tree by the fruit it bears. You know a Christian through the peace, joy, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, self-control. These are the fruits of the Spirit. And unless you are born of the Spirit, you cannot, you cannot even know God. You need to be born again of the Holy Spirit. And the joy that will flood your heart when you know that you have life eternal through Jesus Christ, this world cannot touch you. You know what we do with Jesus said? <clears throat> Jesus said, woe to you when all men speak well of you. It means you're bending over backwards to keep in with the crowd. You, are you? Oh, are you? God bless you. You're bending over backwards to keep in with the crowd. Woe to you when all men speak well of you. Do you know, we get in groups here and we want to, we want to belong to the groups. We need the friendship. We need people to like us, etc., etc. But when you know who you are in God, when you understand and see yourself how God sees you, everything changes because everything he has put in you has got to develop. You don't have to go along with the dirty jokes anymore. You can stand strong in him because you know who you are. You know you have life eternal through Jesus Christ. Amen. You know, sin destroys everything. Your selfishness will destroy your relationship with your girlfriend or your wife. Your selfishness will destroy your family. I spoke to a fella uh, whose family are trying to outdo his inheritance. They've taken it away from him. They've got all the money and spent it without giving him his share. Now there's families for you. So we need to be born again of the Holy Spirit. Each one of us, we need to, to know Jesus Christ. Don't die in your sins when you can have your sins washed away. Like I said, the reason we're here, we're full of praise, we're full of thanksgiving to God, who has come and set us free from our sins, from ourselves. Just going to sing.